What's good everybody? Welcome back to the channel. It's your girl KD and I'm back with a brand new video. In today's video, as promised, I will be showing you guys how to stream slash record in 1920 by 1080 on a 49 inch super ultra wide. If you watch my um, previous setup uh, tour, you would know that I have the Samsung 49 inch curved monitor. It's beautiful. It's a beast. Um, but sometimes it can be a bit um, nerve wracking to record on and stream on because there's so much space and you have to resize everything but it is completely possible to stream a game on 1920 by 1080p completely possible in this video i'm going to show you how to do it right after this intro okay so i know this screen looks really crazy try not to mind it i know it looks weird but um it's kind of what it looks like when you're screen recording but i'm gonna show you guys my settings so the native streaming output is 3840 by 1080 i want to say that's what it is don't quote me uh but in order to change it you're going to come to your settings over in obs same thing in streamlabs you can do the same thing in streamlabs obs you're going to go down to output first and it's going to be a no it's video it's output yes <laughs> you're gonna come over to output first and then output is gonna give you the option of changing the video output and Then from there you're gonna change it to 1920 by 1080 That's what we're gonna do and then from there you're gonna go to video. So your base canvas is this canvas right here that you see on the screen and That's what you see in OBS output scale is what the people will see such as in your recording or in your stream so from there, you're going to also change that to 1920 by 1080. You are going to put this on lens code so that you can have the best sharp image. And then you're going to change your FPS to 60. That's the best way to put it. So in OBS, that's pretty much all you need to do. It's really that simple. So now I'm going to show you guys what it what to do in a game. OK, as you can see, we're here in a bit of Saints Row. Uh, I'm going to show you guys how to get to your settings and change things in your settings now. One thing that I do want to point out is that I am running Windows 11 here on this PC and it offers you to, when you hover over the maximize, and the maximize button in the window, right next to the minimize button, it allows you to separate your screens. Now, um, with that being said, I don't know if that runs on Windows 10. If it does not, there is a application that I showed you guys in my previous video that does divide the screen for you so that you can place your game on one side and OBS on another if you are only running on a 49 inch monitor. If you don't know what that is, please go check out my previous video to catch that application so that you can um, have both screens divided if you're not running on the updated Windows 11. So once you come here into the game, you're going to go to options. You're going to go to display and depending on the game, it's either going to have it under display or under quality or graphics. It depends on the language of the game. In Saints Row, it has it under display. So you want to make sure that is in window mode. Now, the issue with window mode in a lot of games is that they kind of run a little wonky, such as Call of Duty Modern Warfare, because it's such an intensive game. It's meant to run on full screen, but it is completely possible to play in 1920 by 1080 with a little bit of tweaking of the settings so down here in resolution you're going to want to change it from 3840 by 1080 down to 1920 by 1080 and as you can see that's what we have it on here in the screen now what you're seeing is exactly what my stream sees so this is exactly how it looks in game In the native in, in the resolution of 1920 by 1080. So again, I told you guys it's completely possible to stream in 1920 by 1080. Um, you don't have to screen, stream in super ultra wide. A lot of people don't like the black screens at the top and bottom of their of their display when they're streaming out. So like when you stream in the screen's native resolution, it definitely adds black bars. If you guys don't want the black bars or don't know what I'm talking about, go to my Twitch. Katie just games just like this to check out some of my old streams. I think they're still up and you can see what I'm talking about in the super ultra wide view. Make sure you hit that follow button while you're there if you want to catch some gaming content. 
that's not always going to be on here it's it's rather annoying and it kind of squishes the screen down a lot because of the narrowness of the screen it it's really weird looking also streaming in super ultra wide for long periods of time can cause motion sickness because it's a lot for your eyes to take in so i understand why people want to stream in 1920 by 1080 but i wanted to take this time to show you guys that it's completely possible here we are we have the game running it's beautiful playing that new saints row uh but yeah it looks great i cannot complain about it um, but if you want to follow my instructions, um, definitely, definitely go through this video and make sure you do it step by step. Again, this is universal for any game. Any game you can do this with. All right, you guys, that's going to be the end of this video. I hope this video was helpful. If you have any more questions, drop them in the comments below. If you have any concerns or it didn't work for you, um, make sure you drop it in the, in the comments below so that I can be able to help you one by one with each situation. Um, I can do this with 21 by 9, 16 by 9, or it's native resolution 32 by 9. Yeah, so make sure you guys do that. Make sure you hit that like, subscribe, and leave me a comment on this video if you enjoyed it. Um, I hope it was helpful. I do stream on Twitch, twitch.tv slash katiejustgames. That's where I will be streaming a lot of my gaming content if you want to see this actually in action. I also have a reaction channel, Katie Uncensored, where I post reaction videos. Make sure you guys go check that out. All links are down in the description below. And yeah, I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.